Hi, my name is Ilma, and today I'd like to share Psalm 77, verses 11 to 20. Meditate on God's mighty deeds. I will remember the deeds of the Lord. Yes, I will remember your wonders of old. I will ponder all your work and meditate on your mighty deeds. Your way, O God, is holy. What God is great like our God? You are the God who works wonders. You have made known your might among the peoples. You, with your arm, redeemed your people, the children of Jacob and Joseph. When the waters saw you, O oh God, when the waters saw you, you were they were afraid. Indeed, the deep trembled. The clouds poured out water. The skies gave forth thunder. Your arrows flashed on every side. The crash of your thunder was in the whirlwind. Your lightnings lighted up the world. The earth trembled and shook. Your way was through the sea, your path through the great waters. Yet your footprints were unseen. You led your people like a flock by the hand of Moses and Aaron. Psalm 77, 11 to 20. How often do we reflect and remember the mighty deeds of God? We become so absorbed with our lives here on earth that we easily forget the miracles that God has done to show His chosen people His love for us, His provision, His deliverance. In this psalm, the psalmist recalls those times when God made wondrous deeds such as redeeming His people, the children of Jacob and Joseph, and by the hand of Moses and Aaron brought them to the promised land. When we meditate on the fulfilled promises and miracles that God has already shown us, we are strengthening our faith and giving Him praise as well. When we count our blessings, we become more hopeful and, grown our, and, and grow in our trust that once again, He will keep doing His promises. Adoration. Praise the Lord who is faithful to deliver His promises. Confession. Forgive me, Lord, when I don't magnify it your wondrous deeds. Thanksgiving. What can the remembrance of God's miracle do to our lives? Supplication. May we constantly be in awe of all the wondrous deeds of God. Reflection. How can meditating on God's wondrous deeds change our hearts? Well, if we constantly focus on the things that were given to us it's just like gifts when we when somebody gives you a gift you feel special you feel important you feel valued you feel precious and the wondrous and mighty deeds of god is uh, it, it is a sign and a symptom and a, and a manifestation of how much he loves us so when we reflect on the things that he delivered us from or the miracles, whether they're big or small, then it can change our heart from pride to humility. It can change the way we see things. It can change our moaning and groaning to thanksgiving and praise and counting our blessings. So it makes us more uh, positive. It makes us uh, be more hopeful and uh, because we don't focus on on what we don't have, but we focus on what we have gotten, what we have been given. So I encourage you to meditate on the wondrous deeds that God has done in your life, that God has done in the in the Bible, in in, in that is already proven, and and that um, when we do that, there will be a change in our heart that we are going to be thankful we're we're going to sing out loud and worship the Lord and praise him because there's so much that he has given us and there's so much how much present he is in our lives but uh, most of the time we don't see these things so I encourage you to meditate on God's mighty deeds because when you do that you change the way you worship the Lord and you change the course of your life and then you become one in His will. Thanks for watching. I hope you check my website at ilmaars.com for artworks and photographs and behind me is an example of uh, some of my abstract works. Well, I just did it probably two, three weeks ago. 
So these are my most recent ones. So I encourage you to uh, subscribe to this video so that I'll be able to make more videos for the Lord. Thanks for watching. Stay safe. And remember that there might be a mighty deed that God is doing even in the midst of this COVID. So I encourage you to take a look at that in your heart. Examine your heart. Thanks for watching. God loves you. Stay safe.